What up YouTube? It's your boy Ed, Everyday Muscle. Just wanna stop in, say what's up, see how everybody's doing. Today I wanted to talk about, you know, things that we all go through when you hit that plateau or when you're working out consistently and you're not seeing results. Odds are, if you're like me, your diet could be cleaned up a bit. It's just like a car. You can't expect high performance out of a car and be putting in 87 octane. You gotta put in supreme gas to get supreme performance. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna clean up my eating a bit. I'm gonna count my macros. So what I did yesterday, not even yesterday, today on Amazon, a couple hours ago, I went and bought a scale. I'm gonna start counting my macros. I'm gonna weigh out my food and I'm gonna cook it if it needs to be cooked or I'm just gonna eat it. But I'm gonna weigh it out and I'm gonna find out my macros. I'm gonna stick to my macros and I'm gonna do my best not to deviate except for one day I may not count it, which will be like my cheat day where I won't really count macros like that. I'm gonna do it for the whole month of June because that's literally the one thing that I haven't done is stick to my macros. I eat irregularly. As in like, I usually don't eat till like 6 p.m. as you when I first eat and I eat between 6 and 10 p.m. and then I don't even count what I'm intaking. I know for sure I need to intake more protein and reduce my carbs. We each have our diets, we each have different things we like to eat, but one thing is for sure that if we can count our macros and keep track of what's going in and what we're expending, we have a better gauge to get the results of what we're looking to get. So I'm gonna do this first thing tomorrow morning when I wake up. I'm gonna, you know, use the restroom. <laughs> and then I'm gonna weigh myself. I'm gonna see what I weigh first thing in the morning before I consume anything. Then I'm gonna check my body fat percentage and I'm gonna note it down. Then I'm gonna go online, look at a macro calculator and see what my macros are and then pick the macros. I'll try to document it as much as I can and then release a video on it so that way you can see where I'm starting so it can go along the process and see where I end. So once I do that and the scale comes in, I'm gonna start weighing things out to make sure that I stick to my macros. So first day might be a little bit fuzzy, but I'm gonna have to stick to the macros because I wanna see a change. I wanna tighten up my core. And I wanna see a little bit more definition. Right now, I changed my workout split to five days a week. So I can have the weekends off and also so that way I have enough time to do either 10 to 20 minutes of cardio after each lifting session to add more to the calorie burn. So I'm going to keep you guys posted. Uh, feel free to like, comment and subscribe so that way you can see how it goes and then you can implement some of these changes in your life. I wanted to keep it impromptu. I'm probably not even going to edit out the parts where I stumbled across my words because I'm here to provide value. I'm not here to entertain. I want to make it entertaining, but I want to keep it as real as possible. So, but being real, I'm not going to cut anything out. I'm going to be 100% transparent, and hopefully everything that I do helps you along the way as well as help myself. As I said, everyone have a good day. Peace.